thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Icarus. Today, we are going to be trying to make a kitchen. Yeah, I think we're going to try and make a kitchen today. Now, I did spec in to interior walls, which I didn't think I was going to, but I did spec in the interior walls, interior floor. The problem is it takes copper nails, and I can't afford copper nails right now. They're all going into, you know, the, um, the electronics so um, I might be able to scrounge up some copper nails, though, for today. I don't know, because it also goes into my freaking buckshot. I need so much effing copper. It's not even funny. Um, I'm, I am cooking up all the meat. The, all the meat is just about cooked up, and I'm putting it all in here. I've got all this dried meat. I think I'm just going to let some of this go bad. It's just it's just clogging up the works here, and it's really not anything I'm going to be using. I think what we're going to do is we're going to deactivate this. Last episode, I asked if there's a way to cook meat with electricity. That video has not gone up yet. So if there is a way and you guys told me, I'm not ignoring you. I just haven't seen the comments yet. <clears throat> so now what kind of meat are we going to take with us? I think we're going, I really wish I had some bacon, but I don't. So we're going to take some, oh, so that's prime meat. I think you can only have one prime meat active at a time, question mark. You know, what? let's just eat one of each. Uh, yes, one pre you can only have one of these active at a time. That's what I thought. So we have to see which one of these we like better. All right, so we're looking at 100 maximum stamina, 100 stamina, 150 health, 20 re regeneration, 5 experience gain. And this is exactly the same thing. Okay, so they don't matter. Okay, fair enough. I will take 10 of these with me. And what else would I like to bring with me? Man, I really wish I had that damn bacon. Ugh, is this stuff any good? 75 max stamina. Melee attack speed food. Yeah, this stuff's not really that great, but I don't really have another option. Let's just go ahead and eat this. And then we'll just take one of these. Oh, I can make... Where am I? Oh, yeah, I use, okay, so I used all my cream corn. That was what happened. Okay. All right, you know what? Let's make some cream corn. I'm going to go up top and I'm going to take a look at what's going on up here. This guy eats so much and he's not really that useful. I'm thinking to let him just die. Uh, the only reason I'm not is because I would feel bad about it, but... Man, he is, like, just just kind of useless. All right, so that's not growing yet. Uh, that's not growing yet. Some of these crops are bugged. Like, this one right here hasn't done anything for a while. So I'm not really sure. I might, I might pick it up. You know what? I'm going to pick it up. Wait, can I pick it up? Hold on. should be able to. I don't know if you can. Maybe you can't pick it up with crops in it. But yeah, so I can only interact. I can't pick it up. Oh, what the hell? So this thing's bugged, and I can't pick it up. All right, I'll have to look into that, because that's going to be a problem for me. I think I have a couple more that are bugged here. Yeah, this one, I don't know if this one's doing anything. I'm going to have to look at this stuff off camera. Seems pretty freaking bugged at the moment, so... You know, he just might have to He might have to die. And at least it won't be my fault. What's up, buddy? Hey, you like me now. So I did get a mission where I had to make fire whackers, wood rag torches, and wooden hammers, which is great. Because I've specced into all of them already. So let's go ahead and hand this mission in. And maybe grab another one. Let's see where the thing is. Oh, by the way, you see that one right there? That's bugged. It won't leave. That, thing, that thing's been there for days. Like, maybe a week. So, it's been like a week of videos. Like, seven videos it's been there. Alright, one, two, three, one, two, one, two. And that's it. Nope. Nope, another firewalker. Wait, did I not make four firewalkers? And two, three wood hammers? Okay, well, there's the wood hammer. Yeah, I guess I didn't make the firewalker. I should have what I need on me for it. No big deal. Craft that firewalker, bro. These are the best quests. Firewalkers, like any wood items. The only, a lot of times, like, I'll get an item that I inspect into, but it would be really easy to make. And I'm like, well, it would be easy to make. And I'm like, but is it really worth using a point for it? I don't know. Maybe it is. But I usually don't. Oh, boy. Alright, let's come on up here. And let's see what our choices are. Alright, the cooked fish I don't care about. This is probably what I'm going to go for. Sulfur, coal, and iron. Um, although, wood wouldn't be bad either. And co Oh, copper. Never mind. I'll do anything for copper. Anything. <laughs> I'd do anything for copper. <laughs> All right, cool. So let's go take a look at the missions and see if we have a, another mission I'd want to take. By the way, I lost power earlier, and I was like, what the hell is going on? And then I realized the wheel was full of junk.
Sorry, buddy. I didn't want to kill you, but, you know, if I don't, you'll just attack me anyway. So, I kind of have to. It's out of my hands. I gotta get the bones, man. I, can't, I just, I gotta get the bones. You need so many bones per animal, but it's just never enough. You need so much for the freaking epoxy. Somebody said I could use sulfur for the epoxy. The problem is the sulfur is going towards gunpowder for ammo. Which is also kind of important. Um, an easy hunt. Hunt some nearby animals or find the bodies. I never find the bodies. Don't care. This easy hunt. Yeah, 12 rabbits. Get the f get easy hunt. Waste of time, that is. I went ahead and did my rounds. I hit the iron, the gold, copper, sulfur. I did not hit the aluminum. When I went out to the copper, the electric deep mining drill was like not even halfway full. So I'm going to leave the... I'm going to leave the aluminum one to continue gathering stuff. This is what I'm looking at right here. This thing is still uh, processing resources. This is what I've gotten here. I've actually gotten so much iron. Like, I'm actually, I'm a little surprised how much iron I've gotten, to be to be quite frank with you guys. And I usually grab some oxite, silica, and sulfur on the way back when I see nodes. And I'm keeping iron ore in here because you do need iron ore for uh, these resource, for this resource. And I'm thinking maybe you need iron ore for some other resources. I don't know. Uh, ooh, crushed bone. Two bone. And what is it? Output one? I think it outputs one. Is that a bet? Is that more? Oh, hold on. Nah, it's the same. See, when you go to a better res like when you go to better crafting tables, there should be upgrades. Like, you know, like it should be more efficient, I think. So uh, this is what we're gonna do. This is what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and make... Um, oh, we need the copper nails first. Sorry. First thing we're going to do is grab the copper nails. Then we're going to make one of the wooden floors and put it in here. I, I don't love the idea of walking on wooden floors here. Um, but you know what? If they look better, then I don't see why not, right? It's not like an animal's... Get, like, animals have been trying to, like, go underneath the base. And they usually attack the pillars. They don't attack the floors. By the way, I've started putting in walls here. So... Um, I'm, I'm, I haven't like finished it yet, but I'm just going to do it here and there when I, you know, find the time and I have some extra walls lying around. Okay. So, oh, we're still waiting for the sticks. Okay. Fair enough. Um, we're also going to make some of these, um, wooden walls. You know, I got a wooden wall right here. Why don't we just take this out and see what we can do with this? Um, I, I wonder if it works exactly like the stone wall or if you can actually put it in the way of stone walls. This is going to be the kitchen, by the way. Eight. Yeah, see, you can't put it right there because then it's going to take take its place. So it does have to be on the inner part here, which is fine. Uh, I'm okay with that. Yeah, let's make some let's make some of those wooden walls as well. Um, Twelve. You know what? Just make eight for now. I'm going to be very, very careful with my copper. I am in the process of trying to make all of the kitchen items. Uh, I already have the electric stove. There's also the marble kitchen bench, marble kitchen storage, and the plumb sink. All right, so that's the stuff I'm looking for. Um, concrete mix is already done. Composites being made. Uh, we just need the aluminum. Let's just grab all of the aluminum we can. That's uh, in here. I'm just going to take it all, even though I probably don't need it all. And where the hell do I make the comp oh, Yeah, the composites are made in here. Um, oh, that's right, this thing needs power. Shit, I forgot. I always forget that. Now, is it just going to start going? Yes, okay. All right, cool. Hopefully the uh, fridge didn't shut down for any period of time. All right, what else? Let's not worry about that right now. So we got all that taken care of. Let's go ahead and put this in here. And now we're just waiting for the concrete and the composites. Concrete should be almost done. Oh, <laughs> concrete takes a while, huh? All right, fair enough. Fair enough. By the way, if anyone knows any um, any tricks to get rid of lag, because the lag's really starting to um, come into play here. Uh, it's not terrible, it's not unplayable, but it's enough to that I can notice it. And, you know, I am starting in DX11 mode. And if you look right here, I did turn on DLSS mode. I put it on performance. So I guess that would be the best way to do it, right? I don't really know any of that works. And uh, if there's any other things, let me know. I'd prefer not to turn the game settings down too much because the then the games will start looking, you know, bad. But, you know, I, I don't know. That might be my next uh, my next option. I actually turned shadows down and it didn't even help the uh, FPS. 
you know, I noticed whenever I'm playing a game, um, nine times out of ten, if I'm getting lag and I turn things down, it usually doesn't. What the hell's going on here? What am I do? do I have to redo it? Hold on. Yeah, you got to restart it. Okay, fair enough. I noticed, like, uh, with games, if, if I turn down the settings, it usually doesn't help. Or maybe I'll get, like, one or two FPS, and that's a, kind of nothing. So, all right, are these going to be a while? Uh, that's good enough for now. Let's go ahead and put this in here and put it at the top. Actually, it's the only thing in there, so I guess it really doesn't matter. I also have to make another uh, another water wheel for this space, man. Like, um, I, I start water wheeling up this base because I'm going to have a lot of power in here and it's going to suck having to, like, turn things off to use other things and, and whatnot. All right. And more composites, please. Thank you. Put you in there. Take you. We'll make the next thing. And uh, no, we won't because we don't have enough stone. That's fine. Um, oh, oh, I'm starting to run a little low on stone there. I probably have some over here. Yeah, I'm starting to run low on stone. That's okay. I can get stone. I can get stone. I'm going to put my 1% pickaxe to good use, man. Just believe that. All right, so we now have the marble kitchen bench. And now we need the marble kitchen storage. Now, if this, if this isn't refrigerated, is this really going to be useful for anything? I don't know. I'm going to use it anyway. I'm going to, I'm going to make it anyway. We're going, we're going all the way with this, guys. We're going all the way. You're going to make a dope-ass kitchen. Deactivate. Deactivate. And what else am I missing? Oh, yeah, the concrete. It was taking forever. I forgot. It's still going, man. That's right. I made more than I needed. That's okay. I'm sure we'll be using it for things in the future. All right, and the plumbed sink. Beautiful. All right, so let's grab all of... Oh, God. <laughs> I'm encumbered. So, how do I want to set this up? So check this out, guys. You can't actually put down the regular stuff. You have to put this thing down uh, first because everything else must snap into place. That's crazy. All right, I will try my best to put this as centralized as possible. Looks pretty good to me. And then snap. And what is this? That's the sink. Yeah, put the sink on the other side. No, because we want the prep table here. And I think nine is the prep table. There it is. And the sink. We want the sink over here. Yeah, let's put the sink right there and the storage right here. Yeah, that looks freaking cool. I wish I can get rid of these two things in the middle. But if I do, it's going to cause um, structural structural issues. Um, I'm going to try anyway. Oh, hold on. Huh. That's kind of weird. Um, I'm happy about that, though. Get rid of those two. Right? I don't see any cracks. Do you guys? Wow. That's... Oof, that's pretty dope. I'm very happy about that. Really opens it up. Alright, so... Um, hold to access inventory. Um, so, what? Can I put this in there to fill it up? It does not seem like it. Um, pick up. Fully plumbed basin and running water. A luxury of sorts. Okay. Um, maybe you have to run the water to it. Yeah, I'll bet you I, I'm going to need a pump at the, you know, in the water and use the pumps to bring the water up to the sink, which makes sense. We've already looked at the electric stove. We've looked at that. Let's look at this. Oh, okay. So this is, um, have we, we haven't put that down before. It looks, oh, maybe we have. Oh, I see. So, all right. So this thing takes the place of this. Okay, great. And it all it makes all the same stuff, right? Yeah, fruit salad, wild salad, cream corn, animal fat, pastries, pickled carrots, and then you can cut down all the meats. Okay. And then storage. Okay. So the fact that the storage does not have you know power going to it or it doesn't have any kind of refrigeration kind of makes it useless, but whatever. It's part of the it's part of the charm of the kitchen. 
Uh, speaking of the charm of the kitchen, we need to get some lights up there. Um, I did make two lights. Oh, I, I got a mommy, don't I? I did make two lights. Is this going to be enough? Pfft, I can almost guarantee it not. Although it is a sm it is a low ceiling, so it's going to be a lot better of a setup than the one I have in the, you know, the other room. So where do I want to put these to start? Um, I'm thinking right in the middle, right there. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, but I'm going to want to put them in the... Um, so I'm thinking, like, right here. Okay, so let's run some power up here. And I don't love the way the power lines are run in this game, by the way. They kind of run pretty poorly, in my opinion. Uh, the way they go through the walls and stuff, but, yeah, that's alright. I've seen much worse ones. There we go. Okay, so let's go up here, run that through the wall. Yeah, 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 all right. Actually, this one doesn't look too bad. Okay, so I'm thinking like right about there. And then here. And then here. Let's see how that works. Oh, okay. So we're having some power issues here. Hmm, why would we be having... I don't feel like we should be having power issues. That's not running. This isn't running. So we've got 2,000 power coming in. Oh. <clears throat> we've got 2,000 power coming in. This thing's using 500. Each one of the lights is using 100. 150. So that's 5, 6, 7, 8. Let's go 9, 10. Yeah, we really shouldn't be using that much power. I wonder what's going on. Wow, these lights are really good on the lower ceilings. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm thinking one light here and one light here would be perfect for down for this part of the uh for this part of the base. So um why don't we go ahead and we're gonna move that over probably to here. So this one will come over to here. Alright, let's grab this. By the way, the reason the um power wasn't set up is because I, I didn't have the lines hooked up properly to each other. It was a pretty easy fix. Okay, so that's on... Yeah, that's right in the middle. Yeah, okay. So right in the middle, right here. So we'll take this and run it this way. And also run it this way. What? Hmm. I don't know how I did that wrong. Um, Alright, I'll bring you with me on this one. So yeah, that, that should be... Is that hooked in or is that... I might not have hooked it in. Huh. I'm not sure what just happened there. It's kind of weird. The electricity is a little... Unless we ran out of it. No, we didn't run out of it. So this is going through here. All the way to there. This one's going through the wall. This one's coming through here. Going over to here. Yeah, I'm not really sure what's going on with the lights here. I, I, I'm, I'm at a loss. I took all the ceiling lights out of here because I wanted to put them in the kitchen. Honestly, guys, I don't know what I'm going to do with this area. I was thinking about maybe using this um, directional work lamp. You know, maybe if I put one of those in here, it'd be good. I don't know. They're kind of expensive. I'd like to see them in use before I, uh, I try them. And if not, I'll just load this place up with lights, I guess. Just, someone was saying, can't you just put pillars in the middle? No, you can't put... I can't, like, snap pillars into place in the middle. Uh, otherwise, I would do that. Um, you know, I could just put a roof... I could just put a roof over here and not have it be a big open area. But I like the fact it's a big open area. Anyway, let's not worry about that. Let's take a look at the kitchen. I finally got the kitchen all situated. This looks great. I don't know what it's going to look like at night. But as of right now, I am loving the kitchen. Um, I think the next thing is to move the uh, the refrigerator up here. And I'm going to want to make sure this is going to work before I do it. So the refrigerator will go on the right-hand side. So what we're going to do is we are going to... We're going to take this out. Okay. And just bear with me here. We're going to run this. Eight. And we're going to grab this. Come on. What the hell? 
Uh, actually, you know what? No, I wouldn't grab it off that anyway. Grab it off that. So if the kitchen goes right here, we're going to want a break right there. And then another break right here to go to the lamp. And then... There we go. All right, cool. Now we can bring this right here. We bring this um, to the lamp. Turn that off. Lights are all good. And then we're going to grab this one and bring this all the way over here. And that should be able to go right down to the uh, refrigerator. So now we got to empty out the refrigerator. I have a lot of stuff on me, though. We just my, my The inventory is a complete shit show. I know. I'm aware. And I apologize, but what are you going to do? Well, you can organize it. Shut up. <laughs> I will. I'll get there. The whole idea of making the kitchen was to start the organi organization process. Take all. Pick this bad boy up. I'll just pick it up like a like a beast. Ain't no thing. I wish this was snap into place too. But that's okay. It's alright. I will do it right there. Oh, that looks great. And eight. That. Yep, okay. You can see it kind of goes through it, but it's okay. As long as I don't see it. And then we just throw everything back in there. Alright, well, not that. All the stuff that can spoil. I will hold on to this meat. And let's make double sure. Yep, 5,000 seconds. Right here should be about 500 seconds. And here is 5,000 seconds. Between that and the power thing, that's it. That's it. Am I going to need more storage? What else am I going to put up here? Can you make like dining room tables and stuff? Probably won't do that today, but well, maybe. Let's see. Um, no. Let's see a bunch of glass stuff there. I think it's in tier two. Um, yep, wood table. We're definitely gonna want a wooden bed eventually. Okay. Um, small interior. Wood. Yeah, I guess a wooden table. And we're really spending points here on stuff we probably shouldn't be. But, whatever. Alright, let's make some of that stuff. Let's see what, what it's going to cost us. What is it going to cost us? Uh, not much. Ugh. Alright, we need more copper nails. That's okay. That is A-OK. -okay. Where's all my copper? There it is. That's not all the copper, but that's some of it. I'm just going to go ahead and turn all this into nails. No, that's just... No, 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 just don't make any more than you have to. You might need that copper for something. As a matter of fact, you probably will. And... Put that in there. There's no point in holding food on us. When we're not going out, we can just eat whatever. Keep it in the fridge. It just makes sense. Take that and that. We're also going to take 61 coal... Okay, beautiful. 62 is good enough. And I guess we might as well just go do this quest right now, or mission. Yeah, let's just go do the mission right now. Get it going, we'll get another one. There you are. Now normally, you know, coal, 61 coal, I've got coal ore deposits. Now I don't have them, like, set up, but I can, so it's not really that big of a deal. Thank you. That's right. Give me my reward. Where's my reward? Alrighty. This looks like a terrible reward. Can you plant the mushrooms once you get them? Maybe I should get the mushrooms. I already have a food trough. Alright. Fine. Fine. I mean, the mushrooms will come in handy. They make some really good food. The thing is, I don't know if I can, like, grow them. Damn, that was 15,000 experience? Holy shit. Holy moly. That's a spicy bit of ball. All right, you know what? Uh, you know what? I don't think I have any room in any of my grow plots. Let's take a look. Yeah, almost. Yeah, we'll have some room here in a moment. By the way, I am planting soybeans. Because there's a really dope recipe that takes soybeans. 
Yeah, none of this stuff is done. But it's going to be done pretty soon. I'm going to be making something that's going to take iron. And I'm like, <laughs> I got iron for days, people. Ain't no thing. Actually, it's probably not going to be enough. But that's okay. Like I said, I do have a lot of iron. There's one thing I have a lot of time. Actually, was iron not the thing I ran out of? No, there we go. Five more. All right, cool. Actually, we probably did make more than we needed, but that's okay. I'll use them eventually. Let me show you what I got going on up here. All right, I've got this little area here, and I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have a dining area on one side and a dining area on the other side. I think we'll have to see. Uh, we're gonna need a wood pole for that, aren't we? Yeah, we are. All right, come on, give me a wood pole, bro. Craft, take that, take that. Um, we're gonna need another table and two more chairs, please. Oh, this is gonna be a this is gonna be great. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. Actually, yeah, whatever. No, it's fine. It's fine. Don't think too much about it. It's looking good. Just, you got it. Okay. Alright, so I think maybe I'll leave this spot open for, like, this will be, like, a public dining area, and this will be, like, a little bit more of a private dining area. If you pay more, you get the private dining area. And if you, you know, you're a cheapskate, then you gotta eat in the public with the rest of the plebs. And I don't really even know where to put this. I guess let's put it right here. And I can continue building this up as we, as we, you know, go along. Six. Um, place. Rotate. Uh, yeah, that looks good. All right. Place. Rotate. Beautiful. Now let's go set up this, the... Uh, private dining area who's going to be in here dining nobody it just makes me happy guys <laughs> just make, doing crazy shit like this just makes me happy okay you my friend we'll go right there okay and then two more chairs i think we're done let me turn off my timer six and you're good. Now, chairs, I don't mind if they're not lined up properly. Because who the hell has their chairs perfectly lined up under their tables? Not me. And there you go, guys. The kitchen is complete, at least for now. I'm really, really happy with the way it's come out. I think we're going to call this one here. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.